chest x-ray uh, CT scan chest interpretation air crescent sign you are uh, seeing a CT scan image in lung window taken at the level of aortic arch this is obviously left lung clearly showing more than one abnormality in the posterior part of the image there is a fluid density in the middle there is a lesion that does not have clear or smooth boundaries moreover it has an air density trapped uh, within it which is making a crescent shape early moon the sign is known as air crescent sign and can lead you to a very definite diagnosis air crescent sign is defined as a crescent shape air density within a mass or a nodular opacity and the pattern can be visible on plain chest x-rays as well as CT scans some cavities will have more than one crescent this sign most frequently if not always indicates a fungal infection which is also known as mycetoma or uh, fungus ball. Some people will simply call it aspergilloma. If you were to do a biopsy and look at the specimen microscopically, such cavities will have mucus, fibrin, necrotic tissue and cell debris. Presence of air is the result of phagocytosis from white blood cells which create a space towards the edge of the cavity. This space is occupied by air to create an air crescent sign. Mycetoma or aspergilloma is found in patients with compromised immune system or with underlying lung conditions such as tuberculosis or sarcoidosis. This happens because of inhalation of fungus as spores from open environment just as people inhale bacteria and viruses. In healthy individuals this does not cause any problems because neutrophils and micro, ma macrophages that are uh, two white blood cells can easily take care of such invaders. However in patients that do not have a strong immune system this becomes a problem as fungus grows to make a colony. In patients with tuberculosis, now tuberculosis patients have cavities already within lungs and these spores can actually go into those uh, cavities uh, where they do not have any contact with white blood cells and they can easily grow these uh, as, as colonies uh, without being uh, taken care of by white blood cells. Now if I'm not wrong this is a bronchial branch which and there is a communication channel and this channel is supplying air to this KVT and a mycetoma can also be angio-invasive means they can damage blood vessels and cause hemoptosis hemoptosis means coughing up blood hemoptosis is the most common symptom of aspergilloma or fungal infection this hemoptosis can become life-threatening however some people can live with such KVTs for years without any symptom. Antifungal treatments are available to treat such patients. Sometimes surgical removal is necessary. Chest X-ray PA view and lateral view showing uh, a fungus ball and air crescent signs. This is a bit more clear. So this is the the mass and air gradient signs. Uh, another set of images to CT scan slices of right lung and the air gradient sign is present. This patient was given uh, antifungal treatment and the air gradient sign is developing here. The last two images are courtesy of uh, redrounds.com. The images in first two slides have been copied from radiologywiki.org. Thank you very much. And these are the references.
Thank you.